What's up, Warriors? Welcome back to GTV, your one source for news, sports reports, and entertainment. I'm your host, Nick Rose. And I'm Marcelo. And Christmas vacation is just a few weeks away, so make it your priority to attend some missing work. You don't want your parents mad at you right before it's time to get what you want. All right, well, first off, we have sports with Alejandra, Elisa, and Bernice. Congratulations to all the boys and girls soccer teams and basketball teams this week, and I hope you guys do well this upcoming week. Go Warriors! Thanks, girls. Let's cheer on our Warriors at the girls' basketball game tonight. Now Jose and Marcel with Comedy Corner. Story? Three. Welcome back, Warriors. Welcome back. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> cut, cut that, cut that. Oh, what's up, Warriors? Welcome back to another episode of NTV. You guys ever been tired of just hearing all this sad stuff on television? I know I have. Well, good news, guys. Today we're going to tell you about three amazing news going on. Well, I have one right now. What is that? One Direction is getting back together. Oh my god, really? No, not really. Story one. Well, first off, guys, we have Nature versus Machines, a Formula E car race to Cheetah. I heard about that too. Yeah, my money was on the Cheetah. Mine was on the car. Well, anyways, this took place November 28th, and the Cheetah can reach up to 70 miles per hour while the Formula E cars can reach 140 miles per hour. So, obviously the car won, right? I guess so. Right. And look at this. The race was aimed to spread awareness of the endangered Cheetah with 7,000 left in the wild. So, take care of Cheetah. Because they're almost gone. Story two. No way, Jose. What? Guess what? What? Sheep can recognize a human face. No way. Yes, it is. Look at the article. It's right here. So, Jose, tell the audience who the scientist was. Well, the scientist who discovered this was Jennifer Morin. She got eight sheep and put two computer screens in front of them. One showcased a black screen or a random object, while one had a picture of a celebrity. And what and did they get if they got it right? If they got it right, they would get a treat, of course. And they do so by breaking the infrared beam with their nose. Wait, wait, so you're telling me that if I get it right, I can get food too? Next story. <laughs> story three. Hey, look at this, Marcelo. New York restaurant take, takes... Jose, I'll read it. You know, I'll read it. It says right here. Pay attention. New York restaurant takes Thanksgiving indulgence to a new level with a $76,000 feast. I mean, can you imagine that money? That must be a lot of food right there. Speaking of food, I'm a little hungry. What about you? So am I. Yeah, let's go. Right, let's go. All right. Later, Later Warriors. Warriors. And Marcel, you want to hear a joke? Sure, why not? What do you call a fake noodle? Uh, geez, what is it? I don't know. An impasta. <laughs> I get it, because impasta. Yeah. <laughs> it's not funny. I really don't know where you get those jokes from. <laughs> All right, now we have an anime interview with Jose and Marcelo. Do you believe in Santa? Yes, he brings me presents every year. Yeah, I do. Do you believe in Santa? Yeah. Do you believe in Santa? No. All right. Do you believe in Santa Claus? Of course I believe in Santa Claus, you guys. I mean, it's simple logic. How else do the presents get under your tree at night? Thanks, guys. Now we have better choices with Kai, James, and Nick. Dude, cut me. I'm sorry, man. 
Here, turn from me. Thanks, I really appreciate it. Thank you guys. And now, lastly, we have a special segment with Bernice, Alejandra, and Alicia. Gall High School will be having the season of giving. We will be accepting canned foods from December 4th to December 13th. Second period B Day will have a competition. Who will win? Just stay warm. Thanks for watching GTV, and I'm Nick Rose. And I'm Marcelo, and we will see you in the next time, Warriors.